suit yourself. I want you to tell me everything you know about these creatures. Have you seen them before? Do you know where they came from? How many are there down here? I hope you are a believer, brother. When those things come back, you're going to need a higher power to pray to. My name is Lieutenant Colonel Eric King of the United States Air Force. I'm a chief nuclear engineer of the Iraq Survey Group, tasked with locating hidden chemical weapons. Our mission has uncovered something unexpected. I will now begin an autopsy of an unidentified life form. in the hole. That's the last one. Should at least slow them down. Long enough to spot them on the cameras. We should reset that chirp wire. Give me a hand. We've been in some fucked up situations before. Oh, never as fucked as this. If I gotta fight these things, there's no one else I would want by my side. You know I always got your back, buddy. Come with me. Something else. You think? I wonder how many places like this we've bombed without a second thought. These relics are better off in the dust. What's your problem? These people didn't ask for this war. I don't remember them showing much respect for New York City a couple years back. So now all brown people gotta suffer, that it? That's not what I meant. You know me better than that. Yeah, I thought I did. All I'm saying is that this country has its fair share of monsters, right? Does it now? When we're back home, we'll laugh about it. Yeah, maybe you can tell me how you feel about us black folks. Mailman 21 Actual, this is Dropkick. Request update, over. Two in actual receiving. Cameras are green and the holes have been demolished. Over. Good work, Lieutenant. Treat through the eastern corridor and be on your guard. Over. I hear you. Over and out. At approximation, the creature is eight feet tall. Bipedal, winged. Wing webbing appears to be affixed to its forelimbs and to the digits of its hands. Epidermis looks to be smothered in some sort of excretion. Underneath it is diseased almost. The creature is starting to rapidly decompose in death. Dropkick, this is Mailman 21 Actual. Approaching Eastern Passage. Over. I see you. Christ, these doors took a hammer in. Those things must have come through here in force. Whoever manned that weapon took a stand and held them off. Before they got massacred from behind. These creatures aren't dumb. They're predators. Bet your bottom dollar if they came this way before. 
They could come again. Closest I've been to hell. <laughs> Fuck she do to deserve that. Killed by a stake through the heart. Pretty sure those creatures didn't do this. Who did? I don't know. Buffy? Who? Maybe you should hold on to that. Never know when you're gonna need a sharpened steak, right? a hole through the rock face, we found a gateway to a strange world below. A phosphorescence emanated from beneath, casting its eldritch light over us all. Lady Bradshaw was insistent that we descend further. Perhaps Mary is right, and Bradshaw is becoming reckless and uncontrollable. But I can't stop thinking about what's down there. I am now working with Crow and Pullman to set up a winch and elevator to descend into the shaft. What mysteries lie below, I wonder, undisturbed by the world above. What's that? It says they found something weird down here. Yeah, no shit. That's gonna get us out of here. It's beautiful. Right now, I couldn't give a crap if it was the crown jewels of England. Perfect. This looks like a good choke point. Any of those freaks coming up from below are sure to pass through here. Set some charges? Yeah. Yeah, rig these pillars for maximum coverage. More likely to see the trip wires, though. You think those things can tell a difference? We shouldn't underestimate them. We mine the sides. We're more likely to catch them out. Smaller spread, but the explosives are better hidden. What do you think? Those things are devious fuckers. You're right. We plant the charges to the side of the hall. Right, they won't see this one coming. I can hear your brain taking away. What is it? Should have given her a second warning. 
Fuck, man, I wish I hadn't asked. I'm through talking about this. Yeah? What's left to say? You know that checkpoint was a prime target for suicide bombers. We had to act in the moment. We had to make a call. It was the wrong call. Why is it that no one ever tells us straight? Everyone just makes a bullshit to get by. That's why we're in the sandbox in the first place, right? I just want the truth, Jason. Shooting that woman messed with my head. You seriously gonna tell me it didn't mess with yours, man? Those demons down there will kill you, but the demons in here will eat you from the inside out. You gotta let it go, man. I'm serious. Ah, uh, so that's you, all moved on. Yes, I have, I sure as hell have. Nah, I know you too good. When you lie, you always say things twice. First one to see how it floats, second one to nail it down. Nikki, come on. You know I was seeing Rachel. Are you serious? Been three weeks. It's armed. Dropkick, this is Mailman 21 Actual. We're at a stairwell leading down into a maze. Please advise, over. Acknowledged. Pull back now and secure the perimeter. Drop kick out. Mount a camera here, and let's head back. Can't be anything good. The 28th of December. God forgive us. For days we have studied this dead, silent realm and its entombed abominations. Now the horrors have come for my own dear Mary. Crow found her unconscious in the star chamber, her notes scattered around her. He carried her back to our supply room and laid her down in one of the cells. When Bradshaw learned what had happened, she was evasive about Mary's work down there. As I cleaned my wife's face, she spoke to me in a fever, sounding distressed and confused. I have resolved to keep a vigil over her. I pray her fever abates so we can escape this cursed place.
What is that light?
creature has powerful claws and fangs formed from hardened and identifiable tissue. Two of the incisors appear grossly malformed and discolored, oddly out of place. The membrane surrounding the specimen seems to originate from its mouth. Blood is like nothing I've seen. I'll now perform a UV sweep to further inspect the fluids. Hey, some advice? You had your chance to talk. Yes, but the demon does not react well to sunlight. I would be very careful with that light. I said be quiet. Oh, boy. Don't move! Cold check, is that you? Damn you! Shit! Looks like a line out. Maybe we can get the radio working and send a signal out. It's worth a shot. A long shot. Oh, we don't even know if there's a working transmitter on the surface. Those wires gotta go somewhere, though. You think they still work? Well, looks to me like they just snagged up. Just as well. Don't feel much like climbing out there. What the fuck, Joey? Oh, Shit, Joey, it's me! Oh my god. We have to hurry. It's not safe here. that you could fight yeah me either who was that thing i don't know whatever it is it's not alone where have you been one of those things got its dirty hands on me dragged me down here left me for dead fuck fuck doesn't even start to cut it 
I'm lucky to have gotten away. You're talking to a scientist. There's no such thing as luck. You should be thankful I was there to help you. I'm really grateful. Thank you. Semper Fi. We gotta find a way out of this hole. So, this is where you've been hiding out? Do you have any weapons? Uh, do you mind? Just need some batteries for this damn light. You could just ask. That ever cross your mind? Looks painful. Yeah. It is. Think you can keep still? Thanks, Clarice. I saw those same symbols in the shepherd's huts. Those people must have been in the valley a long time. <coughs> There's a way up. There's no way we're making it. Look at it. It's barely climbable. We can make it together. How did I know you were going to say that? I met Eric in climbing glass. I can get us out of here. You okay? Yeah, just need a minute. A minute isn't gonna kill us. Until it does. God, you, you look terrible. Gee, thanks, Rachel. You ever think about going into motivational speaking? Seriously, though, are you okay? That's gotta be about the dumbest question I have ever been asked. Give me the silent treatment, huh? I think right now we should just focus on survival. It's no wonder they call you the queen bitch. Sad thing is you don't even see it. See what exactly? You don't let anyone in. It's like there's a wall around you. No, not, not even a wall, a mountain. Tell me, Rachel. Is there even a real person behind there? It's not easy being queen bitch. You think I got where I am with a soft word and a warm smile? And here's me thinking you Langley types grew up on Easy Street. <laughs> easy Street? I had to graph to get here. You think it bothers me what people call me? I wear that shit like a badge of fucking honor. They have no idea of the shit hill I've climbed just to get to where I am right now. Yeah? And where is that exactly? Looks like another shit hill if I'm truly honest with myself. <laughs> you and I, we're not so different. You know, both doing what needed to be done to get to where we wanted to be. No shame in that. No shame. <coughs> Please. 
What did that thing do to you? Please! Please don't leave me down here alone! It's okay. I'm here. I'll leave you. I promise. But you have to tell me. What did that thing do to you? There's medication up there. It may help you, but we need to move. Now! <clears throat> side of the chasm. We'll never make it. <laughs> Don't quit on me now. We have to swing over. That rope won't hold. Wait! Do you really believe those medicines will help me? We don't know enough about those things. Come on, Rachel. Don't bullshit me. It doesn't look good. Truth is so overrated. If it happens, if I turn, you have to kill me. you turn, it won't be you I'm killing. Maybe it's best I don't. What do you mean? Just do it! I'm not gonna make it. Where's the girl that saved me from those things? I know you can do it, Clarice. You just have to have hope. You're screwed enough as it is. If you stay with me, there's no hope for you at all. 